Bob, what were your thoughts on Mikey Garcia's victory uh, this past weekend in New York? Well, you know, it's very tough to fight a very good, a good opponent who doesn't want to engage. Mm -hmm. And for the first three rounds, I found it to be a very exciting fight. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, Garcia got stung in the second round, wobbled. Uh, and then he came back and really hurt uh, Burgess in the third round. And then Burgess uh, was safety first for the rest of the nine round. I think that Mikey has to understand that if he's going to be a superstar, that when his opponent goes into that defensive mode, that he can't take the bait and just win the rounds. Yeah. But he's got to go out and... Uh, like Marvin Hagley used to say, search and destroy. Gotcha. You know, you mentioned building a superstar. Your company, you guys always had the ability to take a prospect, map out their career, and, you know, whether it's a Miguel Cotto or, you know, and Mikey Garcia bringing him up. I mean, how how do you, does that come about? How does the game plan go for building these guys? Well, the game plan is to, to match them, get them the most notoriety. And... Um, uh, hope that they come through in the ring. The one thing I can't do, whether it's De La Hoya or Mayweather or Mikey Garcia or Pacquiao, is fight the fights for them. Yeah. They have to fight the fights themselves. Got you now. Um, there had been a little talk about maybe Mikey in a year or two at 140 facing Manny Pacquiao. Is that still something you can consider? Well, certainly not off his performance. Okay. against Burgos. Uh, but we're optimistic that as he steps up uh, and fights guys like Gamboa yeah. uh, and is successful, that Garcia is a possibility. Obviously, if Pacquiao beats Bradley uh, in April, that the number one priority would be Marquez. Okay, the number one priority for uh, Pacquiao. Pacquiao. Okay, as far as Mikey, what about him and you mentioned Gamboa? Like, um, do you could you see that really legitimately happen? His next fight, maybe? Yes, if, I think uh, Todd is working on it with HBO mm -hmm. and with uh, Fifty Cents. So I think everybody is serious about doing that fight. May seventeenth being the initial fight that we open up the forum in Los Angeles for boxing. Oh, really? Okay, interesting. Now, you know, you promoted Gamboa several years. You know his potential, but he, he's been kind of inactive. Where do you think his head at is at? How much of a threat is he to Garcia at this point? Well, a, a fighter like Gamboa is a threat to everyone because he is uh, extraordinarily uh, talented. But uh, that's what boxing is about. Where Gamboa's head is, uh, even if I was with him, I, I couldn't tell you because I'm not a psychiatrist and I'm not with him, so I certainly can't tell.